<laughs> hey, everybody. Hey. Hi. I'm Steve. I'm Donna. We're Happy Heart Treasures. <laughs> uh, what are we? We're resellers um, in Lincoln, Nebraska. Rehomers of stuff. And Donna's losing her glasses. Ah. Hey, when hey. you last left us. Okay, yes. <laughs> when, when you last left us, we got all this stuff that's behind us and around us and everywhere else us. And we said... We do have garage sale stuff in the vid in the van too. And he told me we couldn't go. We can't go garage sailing, sailing on Friday because Thursday we got so much stuff. And then uh, yeah. he Fear couldn't missing sleep. Out. And so he's like, well, should we go? And I said, you said we couldn't go. And he said, yeah, but should we go? <laughs> so we got up and we went. Yeah, we went to Ceresco about 20 minutes away from home outside of town and we hit all the garage sales there and then we did come home we were done by 10 30. Mm -hmm. um, we were up there by what 7 30. yeah mm -hmm. yeah we spent another 192 dollars but guys you got a bows what do you do i got two bows two i got two bows. different bows things guys we are like been killing it and that's why we can't just stay home because it is the thickest garage sale season yes. that it is. Like, and it's somebody said something, and then, scared money don't make money. Yeah, so we're like, oh, well, um, okay, let's go. So we thought, let's just give it a shot. We'll go to one town, and we did, and it was great. We didn't get a lot of stuff, but we got really good stuff. And now this is the video showing our stuff from from yesterday, yeah, and from today. Yes. So we're gonna go through this pretty quick. I just got done shipping. We have to go to the post office. I've been listing stuff from the firehouse by, so yeah, check it out, y'all. She's been working that, and we did. When I did my shipping, there was no new states, but there was this pair of shoes, this pair of Nikes that is going overseas, and it is going to London. London. Tree. So we're gonna put it on the map. Next time we are down there, we're gonna put London on the, on the, on the map. All right, guys, let's get into our finds. Okay, if you remember in yesterday's video, or whatever, the Thursday video, we spent on garage sales almost $400. I don't remember the exact amount, but almost $400. And the best find of the day where we spent a good chunk of that money was $150 on a set of golf clubs. And here are the golf clubs. It's this set of Ping G30 irons, and they are on senior shafts. These are shafts for seniors. And they're, in the, they're not in the sun. There, now you can see it. Uh, they're in really good condition. They're used. I mean, you can see there's, you can tell they're used. But when I comped these out, I did see a, a set of these irons on senior shafts that sold for like $430. Ow. So I'm thinking $350 to $450 for those. So that basically makes the rest of this stuff free, free right? All right, Donna, let's see. We just have everything in totes. There's like three totes, or basically, for most everything we got. So we're just going to go through it. Got this cup magnolia it What's says it? where everyone has a seat at the table and i got it because john's verses come to the table john is her brother who passed away and he has it in the wall in his garage yeah. oh. uh we got a pokemon electronic pokemon this is from like he's 2000 electronic so. yeah oh. he's new and he was uh i think he comps for about uh 80 to 100 dollars, i think Jeez. and we got this for i bought 20 dollars. i paid 20 dollars for this got this cup for 25 cents and on the bottom it's jamber and she noticed it because you picked it up because it's so unique handle like, and because of the name i'd never heard of the name before but we looked it up here's a comp for that i can't remember it what was it like was 35 bucks or so. something anyway for one cup so this is not for propagation <laughs> that's for selling yes I got these little moose because somebody I know likes moose. Got this for a dollar. It is um, anchor hawking measuring. And I got this willow tree for 50 cents. Love willow trees. Uh, two cl golf club head covers for 50 cents each. So, you know, these are usually around 10 bucks a piece. Here's one. Here's the other one, so 50 cents, can't pass that up. And the Harley hat. Here's a Harley hat, it's an actual Harley Davidson branded hat with roses on it. Uh, I think they wanted $3, we gave them $2 for it, but since it's Harley brand, we'll probably put that in the booth, honestly, but yeah. we'll look it up first. I got this because it looked like it was vintage and it was 25 cents. Okay. Okay, Tupperware, got a bag of Tupperware salt and pepper shakers 
for a couple bucks. I don't remember how much. Another Tupperware pitcher. I think he was a dollar. I got this because mine, just like this, is falling apart. So I'm going to update it. And I didn't tell you about that yet, okay. but it was 50 cents. This was at the first garage sale we went to where Steve got the clubs and we were there at 7.30 and we they didn't open until 9. So all this stuff is We spent, there. we bought $150 clubs there and we spent $248.75, I think. So we bought a lot of stuff and they had cheap prices. Okay, this is a cup. It's called from the brand, our name is Mud and it says Dog Mom, brand new in the box. And it says, my child has four legs and fur. So, um, I don't know. I may sell it as a cup and I might put a plant in it. Not sure yet. We got some more of these for the booth. Those have been selling and we have not been able to find them this year. So, there's that. At the booth, we get $3 a VHS. Somebody comes in and gets them. All right, that's just an empty bag. Okay, we got a wallet for 50 cents. A bag for 75 cents. It's leather. Are these like brands or are they just like are these dollar auction? Yeah. Or? Okay. This one I haven't looked it up yet, but it's Paul and Taylor leather. Looked new to me for 50 cents. This has several little bags in it. And it looked new. It kind of looks like a Dooney and Burke, but I don't think that's what it is. But anyway, it's that kind of look and got that for 75 cents. Got this for 75 cents. It is new with tag. So that might get listed. The um, handles are inside here. And then this is a vintage salt and pepper shaker. Did not look it up, but it has that same spice of life pattern on it. Another Tupperware. This is the ice cream container for Tupperware. Um, got this mug for 50 cents. I haven't looked it up yet. It's Kimberly Hodges, but it's probably going to be a plant. We've been on a mug Hot. tear lately. Yeah. We're going to turn this into a plant channel. Sorry, Corey. <laughs> um, got this white citrus bath and body works for a dollar. This is still all from that same one. This, I didn't look it up. Got it for, I think, 75 cents. It's a game. Family, the game. It doesn't look like it's been used. It's not even taken out of the package yet. Yeah. So, I thought that might be interesting to check that game out. Yeah, anything a dollar or less, it's it's worth the risk. Etch-a-Sketch was 25 cents. This new Huskers card, 25 cents. That'll go in the booth. This is, I don't know what this is. Oh, I bought this. There's a Fitbit in here. There's a Fitbit with tons of bands. Apparently, they like to change their bands like every single day. But there's a Fitch, Fitbit Charge 2. The bag says $7.50, but there was actually a price tag on it for $2. So I grabbed that right before we left for 2 bucks. This is a Vera Bradley tote. Oh, wow, that's a big bag. It's a big one, and we got it for a dollar. And it's very clean, not very worn. It's amazing. I don't yeah. see any worn spots or anything. So that's Vera yeah, Bradley. Usually the bottom corners especially will have wear on them. Oh, right but here? But ain't, there ain't hardly anything. Mm-mm. -mm. That's awesome. So that, that is a good find. Okay. All right, we found some. There was vintage clothes in here and they were 50, 50 cents, cents or a dollar. 50 cents or a dollar. So all these things we're gonna show you were either 50 cents or a dollar. This is a Walt Disney World shirt. This is not double stitch, but I believe this one was it's Walt Disney World and I think it's made in the USA. It is double stitch. Yeah, it is double stitch. I'm sorry, it's not single stitch, but it is made in the USA. This is a Husker shirt. The t-shirts, the yeah, the Husker shirts were a dollar. So we just picked this up for the booth. And then we picked this one up for the booth. At the booth, we'll get anywhere from eight to $12 oh. a shirt. They had such clean things there. Another one there. 402, that is the area code here in Lincoln. Uh, this one, I believe, is single stitch. Yeah. Yep, this is a vintage Mickey shirt, single stitch. Uh, made in the USA right there, Mickey and Company. Kansas Jayhawks, this one is 50 cents and it is a single stitch. Single stitch. Made in the USA. On a Hanes tag. Yep. This was just new with tags, 2616 Cubs World Series Champion shirt for, that was 50 cents 50 also. Cents. I'm gonna take this off just cause it could hurt me. 
Yeah. It was yeah, a Yeah, you, you can't pass up a brand new shirt for 50 cents. 25 cents for this set of coasters. And I just thought they were cute, you guys. Yep. So 25 cents, that'll sell. That'll sell. And I did pick this up. Oh, an old latch hook? It's a brand oh, new. Oh, the fish. It's fish, yeah, latch yeah. hook. So that was $2. I latch hook when I was a little kid. We all, all us kids like latch hook once or twice. So did that. So there's the first tote. I asked Donna about, I said, I know we got sweatshirts there too. And she's like, oh yeah, that big trash bag. We got there, there that there too. So we got this trash bag here. And this was all from the same sale. So I'm gonna have Donna do that because I see right on top, we got some more Vera Bradley. Oh my goodness, everything was so clean. We got these brand new Tupperware water bottles for 25 cents piece. And another one this, of these Boho bags. Yeah. This was a dollar, I think with kitty cats on it. Kitty yeah. cats sell you guys. Um, this was 25 cents. There are two vintage puzzles on here. Okay. And then they're just beautiful. They were $2. These Vera Bradley, this is a backpack and this is a purse. Oh, well, they're matching. Mm -hmm. Oh, look at this. Got the tags still on it. How much is it new? I don't think it has a price on it. Oh, it does. $92. $92? Oh my goodness, you guys. All right. Picked up. These were 50 cents, I think. 50 cents or a dollar. Okay. Uh, Husker. Uh, what do you call Long it? Sleeve. Turtleneck. Turtleneck. This one, I think, is vintage. I'm pretty sure this was, yeah, made in the USA. H.L. Miller Gold Tag. I've never seen that. This was um, $1. Yeah. $1. This, this is a dollar. Yeah, another dollar. Is this made in the USA too? I wouldn't doubt it. Ah. Let me check. Sport 1. I don't know. It's all faded. I don't want to try to look too hard. And then another a hoodie. For a dollar. Nebraska Huskers for a dollar. Turtleneck. Another, another turtleneck there. Huskers. It says on the collar. It's a Nike. Nike. Yep. It's just crazy that they had all this stuff out. It's Daddy. it was awesome, yeah. For a dollar. All right, here's a Mickey Mouse. Hold that. Keep holding that up here. One second. Uh, not vintage, but Mickey Mouse sweatshirt for a dollar. This one. Oh, I didn't see that you picked these here. This one has Nebraska on it. Right oh, that's here. cool. Yeah, thought that was cute. Cute sweatshirt for a buck. I just kept adding to the pile and so did Steve, so some of the stuff I haven't seen yet. Oh yeah, some fishing sweatshirt. And then we have this one, another sweatshirt for a buck. Can't go wrong with this stuff. And we have another backpack, Vera Bradley. And it's just in such great shape, you guys. No stains, nothing. I don't know if it was even used. That's awesome. Yeah. I did pay up for this. Look at this swingster what made in the mean? USA. I paid five dollars for this uh, vintage a swingster San, San Francisco 49ers satin jacket. Um, it's look not at, worth it's near not as much, but look at how clean that dirty is. Dirty at all. Yeah, that's it's worth. I looked it up and I think it's like 30, 35 bucks, but still five bucks. I thought it might be more, but that's great because yeah, how clean that is. It was not used. Oh, you found a ping hat. I did not know that. 25 cents, yo. 25 cents for a ping hat. That's great. More Husker stuff. Vintage Husker stuff. This is vintage stuff here. Mm -hmm. Another one. Dollar a piece. Nebraska football. Russell Athletic. Made in the USA right there. And another Husker sweatshirt. Man, this fall we're going to be selling some stuff at the booth. Nebraska Huskers. All right. All of them, dollar a piece. How cool is that? Oh, you got more in the bag. This is like oh. 50 cents, a leather. Yeah, that's like from the 70s or something. And then this still has, it's wrapped up. It, it looks new to me. It's called the Animal Rescue Site. And it's got the bags inside. Little 
Paws galore. Paws galore. Little shoulder. Shoulder bag thing? Yeah. Cool. All right, then at a garage sale, <laughs> they had $10 on these. There's two of these blank oh. VHS tapes. Like we said, we get $3 a tape. Um, Donna asked them for all these. There's two packages plus a couple more. And they sold all these for like $14. So that's like 75 cents a tape. So we'll just take them to the booth. We give them, they keep them up front for the guy that always comes and buys them. No big deal. And then a fun one for me, back to my youth. I told these people I found my youth. 1983 Masters of the Universe uh, container here. And in it, there are, how many figures are in here? Here's somebody's little thing. Oh, this was a memory card I grabbed. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Who are they? Can't see them though. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, thirteen characters, and a bunch of their weapons and stuff. I paid forty dollars for this. I don't know what these are worth. I don't know who they are. Masters of the Universe. He, no, man, he of man and Masters of the Universe. Here's he. Here's he man. He. Well, they're both he man. But, I mean, they're a little loosey-goosey, some of them are, whatever, but I think 40 bucks for that many with some of the weapons is a great deal. These um, are all Masters, guys? Yep, they're all from Masters of the Universe. So. Look, look at them all. Look at this bumblebee guy. Yep. And then this What's is... What's this guy, an anteater guy? I, I don't know. He's sticky, though. His rubber parts are sticky. And he's got, like, chewed up. He might not be anything. But anyway, 40 bucks for all that and the container. And somebody's odd. I didn't even I didn't even bicker and try to come down at all. Let Container's a container. little busted, but oh. so that goes like that. Collector case, but it is a little busted up on the edges and stuff. But so that's that. I don't know what else is that we got here. This shoe box has oh a portable DVD player. It's you know, three bucks, and it looks like it's oh. pretty darn good condition. It has all the cords, all the instructions, everything, and they only wanted three bucks for it. So this may not be eBay, but dollar auction. I mean, you can entertain your kids pretty well with a portable DVD player. I mean, we did go out this morning. Last week they loved, the little old ladies loved my Snoop Dogg shirt. That was in Lincoln, so I wore it to small town uh, Ceresco. And them little old ladies, nobody commented on my Snoop Dogg shirt. So I was a little disappointed, honestly. Your wife is a little old lady, so be careful about what she <laughs> I want Little old lady as in 75 and older. You're oh, not okay. 75 and older. Okay. And you're... <laughs> Indiana Jones figures. I bought two of those. I paid, I think, like a couple bucks a piece. What I think they're like $15. Those? They're 2008. So, oh. but just they're new. They're easy to picture, easy to yes. list. Um... This was in a free box. It's blank, empty, blank, empty CD cases. I just grabbed it, figured I'll throw it on the dollar auction since it was free. Can't pass that up. Donna, you bought this. Yeah. This is just a six piece tea set. And I've already listed a three, six setting, I should say, tea set. And I already have one of our own listed that has three plates and three cups so this is six plates and six cups and i got it for seven dollars so we'll just add that to the listing basically uh lunch bags for business purposes the little bitty blow mold it was only 50 cents little santa so we grabbed him i was in the free box these were in the free box yeah they're washcloths or... all right washcloths these look a lot like the ones donna makes only not as good <laughs> this one's thicker. Then it might a be a hot pad, yeah. Huh. Free box? That free was... box, Lululemon bag. Lululemon's bags actually will sell. Put them in so groups of three. Free, we got some candles here. We got Pier 1 pink champagne candle. Still new. Mm -hmm. Got that one. We have a frosted juniper. That it's was a made in Lincoln. Lincoln, Nebraska candle. Yep. Pick that one up. It's new. Mm -hmm. I have a kiddo that likes those. A pair of Allegria shoes. Donna brought these to me, asked, and I said, sure, they look not a lot of wear on the toe. Don't look bad. 
they, they were, were two dollars, I believe. Mm -hmm. Here's a set of hand lotion, and hand soap. It's blackberry jasmine. Er, 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 Ar Ardle, Ari Aret, and Athene. Ath Athene. <laughs> I have no idea what that is. But yeah, a set. So I cannot look at tell that one out at all. <laughs> all right, we got some Tupperware pieces. They're got a set for five. There's five pieces. Okay. Three, four, five. Okay, my turn. Little lovey, fifty cents. Another little lovey, fifty cents. And those are about they're fifteen dollars normally. About right? fourteen ninety nine. Twelve ninety nine to fourteen ninety nine. The reason being is a baby will fall in love with a lovey and then maybe it gets left somewhere or has to go in the washer or something like that and they need another one just like it. So <laughs> that's usually what happens with those. Got this for 50 cents. It's new with tag. Yep. For the booth. And then we went to another one that wasn't open yet and i got i don't even know how many of these i got but she said five dollars for all of them just let me count one two three four five six seven eight nine ten ten of these sets yep fiesta wear right it's fiesta wear yep and then at the same place i got a set of these and they were five dollars for a set of six and I forgot what these are called. Gosh darn it. Anyway, they're the real heavy ones. And I have, I think, five yellow and one pink. She didn't know why they had an off color with the set. But anyway, I got those because they're like, aren't they like $9.99 a glass? Yeah, I think two put of up, them is like $15, $20, So put up a comp for these so people can if see. If I can find it, I We will. have a whole <laughs> box of the dark brown stuff in the house that we got for $8. Remember a while back? We have to wash and get get listed all right this was still back at that first sale where we spent 250 dollars um this we is got the golf clubs. yeah this is a glowing corpse groundbreaker right here she said it works we don't know nothing but she only had i think 50 cents on it or 75, 75. cents and it doesn't work there but i think they've used it so. yeah but 75 cents like i have to turn it sideways up. it glows it looks like this <laughs> so yeah I, I can't not pick that up it's like on the way out, Atari Flashback 5. I might actually play a couple of these games because I actually grew up on Atari. It'd be kind of cool just to try a couple of them, but I'll, you know, if this ain't eBay, it's definitely a dollar auction. I paid two bucks for it. And it's all in excellent condition. Like, everything at this sale was super clean, didn't smell at all. Great, great condition. Yeah. yeah, and then there was one Olympus camera, not a digital camera, but uh, this was this the same sale. Different sale. Different sale. Three bucks. I think I comped it, and it's like twenty-five, thirty dollars. It's an Olympus Trip AF fifty. I think AF means something different in that one. <laughs> <laughs> then back back at the first sale, the really good sale. I got two sets of these. I did pay five dollars a piece. I'm hoping it was worth it, but I think. What are those? Nineteen eighty-four soda can collection from the Big Eight, and they're cans. Oh, let me see. They're oh. not dented. Here's the Husker. I'll pull the Husker one out. Let's hold the thing up and we can like, see Like, they punched oh, holes in the bottom to empty them, and then they kept the cans from 1984. So there's one for each of the big eight teams. Oh, they came as a party Yeah, pack, they came They came full then, of soda. Oh, okay. Yeah. Can so, you tilt it up so we can see? Oh, yeah. There we go. So I got two of those. Um, wow. They can... Maybe marketplace, maybe the booth, maybe How dollar auction. I don't know. Five bucks a piece, but yes. I really think that was probably worth it. And then Donna wanted some more silverware, so we got her some more silverware. <laughs> Didn't look it up or anything, but it's an Oneida set. And was this one of the five dollar one? Uh, maybe five. Or the eight dollar one. No, I don't. I don't think we got the other one. I think it was five dollars for this set. But there's a bunch in there, and there's a pattern on there. There's the pattern. So, Donna will look into those and find out if there's worth something. I'm sure, there were something. That might be everything from yesterday. We're not sure because everything kind of got a mess with the buyout. We do have some stuff from today. We're going to go through that quick and then we're going to wrap this up. I know these videos end up being pretty long, but 
we're gonna do the best we can but we did find a few really good things today so we don't oh, want to miss out on those we gotta show you those all right we're gonna go through this pretty quick because yeah it's getting kind of late and she's telling me to smile <laughs> and it's already 4 30 and we gotta get a trailer and we gotta go oh to my post goodness office. okay uh one dollar a piece guys um not a fan hey. but what no poo-pooing not a fan at all of the chiefs <laughs> but for one dollar i'll pick that up and most of this is booth clothes as you know this is a starter this is a made in the usa Ooh, it starter was a dollar from natrone means or what for a dollar was it for a dollar yep wow oh i might have give two dollars i think i give two dollars for all the jerseys uh yeah and then this is a looks like oh basketball I don't know how old it is but nebraska basketball reversible it actually is reversible so on the inside nice. there's this so paid a couple bucks for that it's an adidas uh this is unfortunately USA. this is a chris mullins jersey but it's a usa basketball from the dream team uh back in the old day too bad it's not a jordan one huh oh wow uh and then these were a different sale we paid not much by a dollar three dollars three dollars three dollars but it was there's an ashworth which is a good brand it's like a golf company huskers wow. pullover for three bucks and then there was this nike husker pullover nice. three bucks a little bit of standing on that one i see now but and then this jan sport Ooh, zip. zip up Husker one for three bucks. And then at Ooh, like one of the Broncos. first sales. We helped a lady put her tent Sports out. Sports Illustrated Broncos pullover for 75 cents. Oh, there is a big stain in the middle. We can get that out. But we'll, we'll try to get it out. We'll put it in the booth. And then there's this Broncos one. 25 cents. 25 cents, yeah, 25 cents for t-shirts there. So that's the clothes from there. We're really focusing on the booth when it comes to the clothes, not so much eBay, because we haven't listed clothes for a long time. We're actually debating what if we're gonna keep doing clothes, but all right, should we here? Let's do I got two baseball gloves, paid a total of seven dollars for them. I know one of these is like twenty-five, so I didn't even look up the better one of the two. So nice. I grabbed those for seven dollars. Here's a Garth Brooks hat. I just figured, you know what, this is probably like a tour hat, mm -hmm. I'm guessing, and it's still got the cardboard in it. Very clean, very little wear. I uh, picked that up, and then I picked up, it's called Vegas Golf the Game. There's chips in here you use when you're golfing. I don't know exactly how it works. We've got the instructions. But there's instructions, and if I bought the game, then it came with these emoji golf balls. So I just picked them up. Oh. Okay, I got a set of two of these. These are Pioneer Woman again. Yes. And that was more dollar for the two, and for the pair. And then these baskets... I lost the sticker. I think that was 75 cents right. and a dollar. Right. It just flipped it right there. 75 cents, yeah, and a dollar. And I'm going to use these in a the booth and I'm going to put the cup cozies in here for sale. And then we got this. This is from a local axe throwing uh, place and it's with a $25 gift card. She said she wanted it at a fundraiser and never used it. So we paid $5 for the hat and the gift card and then three dollars for this ink it's new and expired 2022 which is not that old and that's worth like 20 to 30 dollars i think okay for myself i got a new keychain for 25 cents <laughs> it's a pig that's cute and then i got this for 50 cents and it is a 1988 recipes that's a big old recipe yep, book it's from seward okay and because seward is the what do you call it Fourth of July Capital. Fourth of July Capital. Okay, I got this for 50 cents. Love these containers. These are Tupperware. Got this for 50 cents. It is a vintage Tupperware. Um, just sold one of those actually. And I got this for 50 cents and it is a spaghetti container. You can measure your spaghetti in there and that looks brand new. I got each of these puzzles. They're Cobble Hill puzzles. The guy said his wife did them and they have all the pieces um, for 50 cents a piece. This one's photography. This one is, you guessed it, flowers. And this one is fruit pie. So 50 cents a piece. That's a good brand name for puzzles. Okay. So got that. And then, ooh, let's see if this shines. We're gonna test this out. Does it glow? 
No, no, that glows. I don't think Darn it does. It. Darn it. <laughs> that was, it was in a free box and I was like, does this look like it could glow? Does it look like it could glow? And I'm like, maybe, but maybe. it was free. So it was worth a shot without <laughs> knowing. Because I don't know anything about it. However, we yep. did get a green wine bottle that had been heated and stretched. So it's for a single flower. Thought that was cool for a dollar. You got this. Uh, paid two dollars. Limited release watch. It's a Mickey Mouse from Disney Parks watch. Didn't comp it or nothing, but for two bucks with the case. But you can't go wrong, I don't think. Got this beautiful. It's a, a vase that lays down for flower for a dollar. Okay. And then you guys this this is an austin reed and it is a what do you call attache, attache case, I think. case like a briefcase and it's leather and i found one listed for 75 dollars. i didn't find any sold but it was just real quick um but it's in great shape yeah, here's the, Got the strap. shoulder strap yeah. But it's awesome. It feels good, smells good for one dollar. Yeah. So one dollar, like guys. You can't not. Yeah. Harry Potter crochet <laughs> kit. Of course you guys know I have to get it if it's we did sell the friends one. To a friend. The oh, to a friend kidding. that we bought a couple grassels ago. We have a Tom and Jerry got it for a dollar. Funko Pop. They're oh. not major, major sellers, but we got it for the booth. So Tom and Jerry. Yeah, we'll put those in the booth for probably, I don't know, 10 bucks each or something. Um, and then this we is- We will have to take this out of the box because it's pretty cute. Super duper cute. Got it for $5, I think. We paid five for it? I don't know. Three, I can't remember. Hold on. Look at this. I Love never dies and look at them. They're skulls. Aren't they out cute? Sharing soda. Isn't that cute? <laughs> Love it. Just one. Oh, this is at the very last sale of the day, and I was done in there. There wasn't I'll hold much them up room. You talk about them. And look at this, Mikey. <laughs> look at this. It's 1995, new with tags, San Diego Chargers Conference Champions. Single stitch. It's the year they went to the Super Bowl against, I think, the Steelers. But that is vintage there. Go ahead. And from, I think, the same year, yeah, the Chargers Niners. Chargers 49ers. Look at that. Brand new with tags, single starter stitch. made in USA, single stitch. Still got the the sticker on from the NFL. And there's the next one with tags, Super Bowl, right there. Is there anything on the other side or no. just okay? Single stitch. Yep. And there's one more new with tags. I think that might be the same shirt. But yeah, all for fifty cents a piece. Yeah. How cool Crazy. is that? They're even clean. They're not even yellow. Right. Do you got these? I grabbed these. They were a quarter a piece. Rugrats, uh, Hallmark ornaments. I don't know if they're worth anything, but for a quarter, it's Rugrats. It's definitely worth a shot. We'll put them in the booth if nothing. And I got this because it's Star Wars. Yeah, she grabbed that blanket. Okay. Star Wars blanket. For we're trying to knock dollar, this out. I think we're trying to hurt. Sorry if we're trying to rush, but. Got this for 50 low. cents. For people that are debating whether or not to do clothes, we sure bought, <laughs> bought a lot of clothes. Oh my goodness, 50 cents. <laughs> 50 it's... cents for this jacket, you guys. Yeah. For the booth. Can't go wrong with that. Um, and the thing about all the clothes for the booth, we, the section of booth that we have is like in a back, kind of a circle U section. And we're actually going to be taking over the entire section the entire u so we're gonna have where we have one rack of clothes now we're gonna have at least another rack on the other side and we're mm -hmm. gonna have like double the capacity at least Dan for clothes we're gonna have do -dads. and we're gonna have more doodads and collectibles so we're actually intentionally getting more for the booth because we're gonna be filling in that space within the next couple weeks all right what else you got i don't know what that but it's from berlin it's a leather purse lit can you say that word lit Li li skinned I don't know. Anyway, there's a leather purse. She gave that a shot. Uh, oh, this was that little old lady. Coach purses, two dollars, and it's it's got and there's no like stains or anything. Is this, it there's solid there's solid rings. So I mean, 
We'll look them over good. Yeah. But for two dollars, you gotta give it a shot. And it was a lady that was having this garage sale that with a coach didn't dust. didn't know nothing about the stuff. It was like her kids' stuff, and she's like, I don't care. Just I just want to sell it. Three dollars. Same thing here. They're solid. Um, it's got the. Yeah. This one has a little bit of stains inside, just a little. Yeah. But that's kind of. Yeah, we haven't cool. listed any of the purses from a couple weeks ago yet, but. And then this is. A little Patagonia fanny pack, looks like. Yep. For what, a quarter, 50 cents? Um, that wasn't the sticker that was on it because. Yeah, whatever. I don't know. Anyway, for cheap. Then you got this. And then this, they had a whole bunch of sports cards. I only got this because I pulled it out and I saw a couple I thought might do pretty well. But I don't know what. I don't want to go through these right now. But, oh, well, there's John Elway. Um, so anyway, I don't know what's in here. It was four bucks for this box. She was selling a whole bunch of others. They weren't hers. She didn't know nothing about them. I just thought I'm going to grab it for four bucks. What happened to the little pig I got? <laughs> Mickey! I think there's a box missing somewhere, but that's okay. Okay. We got more purses? What do we got? That's a bad lunch bag. Got this at the same one where I got the leather bag. It is a nativity and I love it. I think it's gorgeous. For a dollar. We might actually have to cut a few of these things out because this is going to be a long video. The people want to oh, see. Oh, that's cool. And I got I that. that for 50 cents. Wow. I got this for free. That's like bright red. Yeah. Beautiful. That's for free. Another tub work scoop for 25 cents. And then this for propagating. And it was 50 cents. Got this whole bag of bath salts and stuff for $2. Got this is just a lunch bag for a dollar. Might be personal use. That kind of thing. This is a brand new cotton throw for a dollar got these for a dollar it's a set of the soup mugs and we got this for three dollars it is a starbucks it's 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 like it's, how do you texture like it's it. it's got all these little pointies on it so thought we'd give that a shot got this activity for 25 cents 25 cents you guys mm -hmm. you know that's old yeah had to get that and then this one Mama, if you're paying attention, I know she remembers this. This was back from when I was little. We had a nativity that looked a lot like this one. Turn it towards the light. Well, there we go. Yeah. What'd you pay for that? A dollar. A dollar for that. Pretty cool. All right. And then I have a few more things and we're done. I got this pair of Echo golf shoes. I did pay up. I paid like $7.50, but I thought they're in really good condition once I dust them off. I looked them up and I think it was like... 40 to 50 dollars for these so i grabbed those at the very very last sale i was burnt out i was like okay this is the last sale in this town then we can go home i was in this little building and it was little narrow aisles and you couldn't get past anybody so you had to wait for people and i'm like finally until dawn i'm like i'm getting out of here i'm leaving i'll see you when you're done and that's fine i go outside and there's like two shelves outside and outside and then booping here sits, back in <laughs> here sits a bose sound wave whatever Bose Wave music system right here. Instead of one remote control in it, there's three Bose remote controls in it. Nice. So I don't know which one's for it, but three of these. If this does not work, I paid $20. I just paid what they were asking. If it's parts or repair, it's worth $50 to $60. If this works, it's worth about $150 or so. So I got that. At one sale, this little lady was selling stuff. She had $1 on this. And this is a Sony sony handycam hybrid look at that nice. and that was one dollar so we'll see if it works i don't know if it works but if it doesn't work i can get my money back for parts repair if it does work i think it's around fifty dollars lastly my favorite find of the day i think this is a pair of bose glasses they, there's are they safety glasses there's another i think they're safety glasses because he said he used to wear them at work and then he said there's a pouch with sunglass lenses he said they were new i don't know if they're new but these oh. are bluetooth bows oh they're speakers and they're speakers right here so when you wear them you hear the music and he had me test them he synced up to it and stuff and they sound real good and i looked these up i didn't look up the model number because i can't see it i need to it's really small and this anywhere used from 
honestly from seventy dollars to three hundred and fifty dollars so i don't know this oh, model number my goodness. what it's gonna be worth but i paid fifteen dollars for that nice that's it y'all that's kind of it there might be some more things that we missed but you guys were you hold it we're out of time <laughs> it's hot in here we're trying to hurry and we yeah we got things to do so we so, just wanted to do this and show like you what and we subscribe, found subscribe share with your friends the last video we put out is going up 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 thank you all for yeah, watching after, sharing after it and subscribing first 18 hours or whatever it's yeah. one of 10 which is awesome we thank you guys so much thank for you, viewing you. our videos we appreciate that so. yes uh, we're going to get to work and then we're going to list, list, list. We're going to spend the next week and a half for sure. Because look at all like we have to get rid of. Woo! All that. Well, you know what? We can get rid of it. I'm sure of that. We've gotten rid of more than that before. We've been in worse shape than oh, this man. before. Remember when we bought that whole store when we very first started? Yeah, yeah, oh, that man. was crazy. Uh, and we have a small clean out to do tomorrow morning, so we have to go get rent a trailer yep. and go to the post office. So. Thanks everybody for watching. We're happy our treasures. I'm Steve. I'm Donna. And we will see you on the next one. Bye.